Hey, it's Joel. We're going to do a fan mail Friday, but look who's next to me. Sydney. Sydney's here. She's going to help me open some stuff because she actually got a box. She got a box. It was addressed to Sydney. So she's the one that has to open it. Yay. So uh, without any further ado, this is Fan Mail Friday. Yay. Uh, welcome back. We've got packages to open, but first, before Sydney opens her package, she's going to do it first. I have to mention, today's Fan Mail Friday on a Saturday, on uh, a Saturday. Saturday, is actually sponsored. Uh, I would have run this on the Friday, but the printed solid Maker Box video was on Friday, and I do one video a day, if, if that. So, you get a Fan Mail Friday on a Saturday, Yay. and this Fan Mail Friday is actually sponsored by 3D Simo. They're having a really great Black Friday sale. I've tried their 3D pens. They work incredibly well. Stay tuned to the end of Fan Mail Friday to see their, their commercial. They have a commercial. Cool. Or like, a, like a new website. They're showing it off. They're sponsoring this. They're making it so that I can make content. So, thank them by staying till the end and watching that little clip. But for now... Sydney, you want to open up your package? Okay. First, let's move these to the side. Let's move it to the side. Okay, it's it's addressed to me, but go ahead and read what's on it. It says, Sydney's, Sydney's first, first Hanukkah present. Hanukkah present. Some assembly required and empty spool not included. Well, we've got lots of empty spools. Yeah, you have a whole wall. I'm not good with knives. Do you want me to do it? No. Do you want me to do the don't. knife part? Don't cut what's inside. That's why I'm not good with knives. Wait. So here's a tip. Oh yeah, you have to cut the side. Because it's taped. It's just kind of do that. So there you go. Don't like cutting towards myself. Well, there we go. just do it the same. What about the other side? Don't shortcut it. Let me get the knife out of the way. And inside we have... A letter. Okay, we got a letter. I'll set that to the side now, because we want to unpack it first. So we got a letter. Um, I think that's part of a dreidel, but I'm not sure. And then there's another one. And then there's a mini dreidel. I think that's how you say it. And then there's that thingy. And then a blue one. Probably for those, one for each. Could be. And then there's money. How much is there? One. Ah, oh, ready? You, you do this. This many. Oh. <laughs> you can count at the end when we're okay. done. How about that? Okay. So I just wanted to show them this many, and then you get to be the one to put it in the box. How about that? Okay. After you count it. Okay. So we're done with the box then? Yeah. What's inside? Um. What do they look like? I think it's a dreidel. The dreidels? Well, part of a big dreidel, and then there's a tiny one. Yeah, that goes pretty well. You want to read the letter? Yeah. If you're feeling especially adventurous, you can sing the dreidel song that has been passed down from generation to generation. I have a big fat dreidel. It's made from PLA. When my print job cools, oh dreidel, I shall play. Happy holidays, Gary. P.S. Oh, thank you, Gary. P.S. Joel, I know that you like to print things big, so I have also included a regular regular sized dreidel so that you can. Sound it out. Cavell. Cavell about how much bigger the one that I made is. <laughs> cool. Thanks, Gary. Empty spool dreidel. Wait. What? Empty spool dreidel. Okay. Probably like that. I would imagine it probably goes through. So, so I bet this goes on the bottom, right? And then the spool would go in here. And then this would go on the top, and it would spin around, right? Yeah, but I'll still win. I'll beat you. Well, I'm not even trying, so of course you're going to beat me. These are cool. Thank you so much. Do you want me to find a empty spool? Yeah. I don't know if I have any empty ones. I have a lot of full ones. Why don't we try a full one and see what happens? Okay. Okay. We're going to choose this filamentum PLA Crystal Clear. Why are you tightening it? Because that's what I thought you were supposed to do. Well, no. It, it, the spool goes in between here. Oops. So, I don't... I don't 
I don't see why. I don't see why it would go on the top because there's just not enough room. The noise. Yeah. Squeak. That's fun. Okay. I believe it goes like this. <laughs> it's like the easiest. So it's supposed to be an empty spool. We've got a full spool. This one makes it heavier. It does make it heavier. Oh boy, those noises. Okay, ready? Do you want to spin it? Okay. It's a full. It's a full spool. I don't know if it'll work. Well, that's heavy. <laughs> there we go. Yay! It's going pretty well. I don't know if that'll work too well. Well, I want to say thank you to Gary for the awesome, cool gifts. And thank Gary you. also gave us, ready, ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight dollars. Thank eight you. Eight dollars because There's in Hanukkah there is. Eight candles. Eight crazy nights. Hanukkah lasts eight nights. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So do you, want you. To put, do you want to put it in the question mark block or do you want me to? You. Okay. Ready? Yeah. Sydney and I just noticed, because we read this side, we didn't read this side, and so now Sydney has to read this side. Dear Sydney, last year around this time, people started to send a lot of stuff to your dad for Christmas, but I didn't notice anyone sending sending anything to you, nor did I notice anyone send anything for Hanukkah. Also, you have been my favorite child of Joel mm -hmm. ever since you picked the previous package that I sent to go First on Fail Mail Friday on 18th May 2018. Thank you for that. You're welcome. So I decided to send you parts for an empty spool dreidel. Well, full spool now. <laughs> um, I sent one for your dad as well, so he shouldn't feel left out, but you got to pick which one goes to whom. You send... You, ugh. Oh, this is where he talks about needing, how we put it together. Oh. Uh, and we did that. We figured that part out. It took us a little bit. Yay. It took us a little bit, but again, again. Thank you. Thank you. All right, Sydney, what package is next? The one that says fragile. Okay, well, let's be very careful with it. Okay. This is from a James? Cursive? I think it's a James. All you said I read was cursive. You said cursive. From a James. It's fragile, though. I'm kind of scared to open this, so I'll, I'll do this. Oh. <laughs> Uh-oh. Here, put this aside. Is this the MacBook logo? Because we have MacBooks. Not MacBook. No. Chromebook. No. It says HP. That's what Chromebooks have on them. Does Is it? Yeah, that's cool. This is from James. Hello, Joel, the 3 printing nerd. Several videos back, heard you say that you wanted a microscope. I hope that you can find use for this one. Sincerely, James A. Monk. Oh, cool. hey, look at that. Whoa. This is a USB powered microscope. Whoa. Ooh, thank you. This could be kind of fun. We'll have to look at everything. We can look at this stuff. We could look at that stuff. Wow. Thank That's you, James. Cool. We will we will put this to good use, right? Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. Maybe you could show it on video. I will have to show it on video sometime. That's right. We'll look at some stuff under the microscope. Thank you, James. Thank you. Give him a high five. From him. That was a good high five. What's the next one, Sydney? This one. The envelope. Do you want to open it or do you want me to? I'll open it. Okay, who's it from? Um, Flip it over. It's... Sender... Chris? Maybe. Let's open it. Let's open it and find out. Yeah. Sticky. Sure. It's an envelope. It's sticking to me. Wow. Oh my goodness. I can't open an envelope. Here you go. Oh, thank you. Inside we have. Oh. Whoa. Look at that. Whoa. That's ten pounds. Times two. Can I see that? You can see it. This is from the fourteenth of October. This was more than a month ago. This, and it's from Chris. And it's from a Chris. I was right. Let's see. Oh boy, this is this is a long one. Wow. Oh my goodness. Uh, 
Well, this is like a letter to me. Okay. I don't know if this is to be read out loud. So we'll read this. We'll read, we'll read this a little bit later. Okay. So we, I will, I will read this later. This is, this is actually a nice little note. This is from Dr. Chris. In Cornwall. Well, these are Thank cool. you, Dr. Chris. Yeah, these go to the kids. Do you want me to put it in or do you want to put it in? I'll put it in. How much is ten, a pound in the U.S.? Or I how much know. is 10 pounds? You can do one and I'll do one. Okay. Ready? Just fold it that so. Okay. Put it in with authority. There we go. Good job. Thank you. Thank you. Three more left, Sydney. Which one is next? You choose. I'm going to choose that one because I've already opened it a little bit when I got it at the coffee stand. A coffee stand is my P.O. box. When I got it there, they wanted to see what was in it. And I just, yeah. I went like this and I was like, it's foamy. So let's see what's inside. It also Ready? says hashtag high five on it. Oh, it does say. It does have a hashtag high five right there. So I'm going to take the foam out. Take the foam out and, oh. oh, it's like a person thingy. It's a me. Wait, can I see this? Be careful with it. Use some paper. More foam. Whoa. Okay, there's a lot of stuff. There's a lot of stuff to unpack here. Here, hold on to that, Sid. I have an idea. I need a little, oh, there we go. Just a little bit of light. There we go. Touch. Yeah. Cool. Okay, hold on to that. Put the light away. Let's move the foam to the side in this little clear protective plate. And, oh, look at that. There is five US dollars right here. There is uh, Adam the Hip Nerd Drawstring Fixer. Drawstring? Wait. Oh, and an envelope. We're going to be doing some stickers. Okay, so I'll read the letter first, okay? Okay. Dear Joel, my handle is Adam the Hip Nerd. I do 3D modeling and design, 3D printing, and I've just started CNC woodworking. I sell custom 3D printed halftone images like the one I just showed you. That was awesome. The Drawstring Fixer and other creations through my website, hipnerd.com. I hope you like the halftone. It looks best from a distance, but once you see the image, it's fun to get up close and see the individual blocks that make it up. Also, the background is printed with translucent filament so it can be illuminated from behind, which is what we did. I found your channel when looking for 3D printing resources when I first started, and I still and find it entertaining, educational, and inspirational. Thanks for all you do for the maker community. I bought my first 3D printer, a Tronix Y kit, a few years ago. I didn't even think I would get it running, but much to my surprise, I did, and I've never looked back. Regards, Adam the Hip Nerd. And there's a QR code for his the YouTube channel. And uh, here's his card, and he's got uh, the drawstring fixer. It's like a little bullet of sorts. The drawstring fixer. Interesting. That's I think cool. I think it's for putting on like drawstrings of yeah. like zippers and stuff maybe yeah. or no 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 oh you know no 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 oh for hoodies you know if your string gets pulled through I thought that was what you were talking about oh no I was talking about the zipper now the the string oh. that goes through the hoodie if you attach the string through here you can feed this through and then pull it through cool. I might actually use it. It's hoodie season now here in the Pacific Northwest. It's always hoodie season. Okay. I do happen to have a self-addressed stamped envelope. So, first things first. We gotta get business taken care of. You or me? Me. Okay, ready? Good job. Adam, the hip nerd. Mm. Ready? You get a sticker. You get a sticker. Oh, Sydney. We have two more. This one. That one. Okay. Who's it from? I was about to say that was the name of That's from International Standard Small Parcel. It is, uh... Oh, Royal it's from It's from this person, Lee, Lee Smith. Lee Smith. Lee Smith. Oh, but there's a... There's an address. I don't really want to see the address. Okay, and inside we have... A letter. A letter. Oh, look at that. It's... It's more clear. It's five pounds. This is interesting. You want to take a look at that? Yeah. I don't know what it is. I mean, I know what it says. I just don't know what it is. 
Dear Joel, the 3D printing nerd, I was inspired to make my channel logo as a maker coin of sword and it turned into a bit of a mission as I made it from up to four parts that clipped together with very small tolerance between them. I was a little heavy handed with my tappy tap taps and made a few small holes, but I ran out of blue PLA and will never get it apart anyway, so I decided to send it as is. I like it. Do you like it? Yeah. It's like his logo. Kind of cool. cool. I started watching your channel after seeing you with Bill. I tend to like people more than the subject on my favorite channels, and I love your enthusiasm and sometimes childlike joy when you make something that turned out good. Watching makers like you not only gives me ideas and techniques, techniques I would never have had before, but also the drive to keep learning and making myself. I included a small donation for your hospital fund as a thanks for all the fun content. Best regards, Lee. DJ Legion! Smith. Lee, so, DJ Legion. Bwah, bwah, bwah. Let's take care of our business. First things first. You can make that sound that you just made. Ready? Oh. Ready? Last one, Sydney. Which one do we choose? The last one? Yeah. Okay. Oh, it's light. Is it light? Yeah. Uh, oh. It is kind of light. May I have the knife, please? You want to cut? Yeah. Will you be careful? Yes. Fantastic. There was totally no hesitation in that. There it goes. I'm going to show you a trick before you do that. But I did it. Oh, okay. But let me wait, 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 wait. There's no need to start there where you're digging. Look at this. Cool. Right? You can do that. I don't want to put it away. Okay, I'll put it away. And inside we have, it's like packing Paper. material. And there's stuff in here. And yeah, and then there's this note. Okay. That's fun. Do you want to read it or do you want me to read it? You can read it. Okay. Hey, Joel, here is the bracket. Twitter handle is at life, life enabled. Hope to get it to you in... Hope to get you to Guatemala. Brent, wow. Oh, this was sent for the... Uh, I don't want to go to Guatemala. It'd be fun. Look at that. This was part of my brackets. So this person printed the... the bra Ooh, it's nice and sturdy. And it's printed with... It looks like... Uh, oh. You want to know something cool? I think because the pattern on this, see how the look at see how the pattern's like this. Uh -huh. So I believe this was printed with a belted printer, where the build plate moves. You have some of those. I don't. You do. But feel how strong it is. I thought you had one of those, right? I don't. Did you ever? No. Nope. Well, not one that worked. Pretty cool, huh? Yeah. Thanks, Brent. That's awesome. Well, that was certainly a lot of fun, and now we're at the part of the video where I've, this is the first time we've ever done it in a Fan Mail Friday, where we're uh, going to hear a message from our sponsor, 3D Simo. Thanks again to 3D Simo for sponsoring this episode of Fan Mail Friday. Thanks to Sydney for helping me open up some stuff. If you'd like to send anything into the channel, of course, it's never required, but the address is in the description of every video that we put here on the YouTubes. Did you have fun? Yeah. You? Did you like that little dreidel you got? Yeah. That was Thank cool. you. I already forgot his name. That's okay. When we watch it back, we'll see it. That's the best part of video. Thank you, name. <laughs> Thank you, name. If you made it this far, you're awesome. Don't forget to subscribe. Hug each other more. I love you guys, as always. High five. High five. Ooh. That was a good one. Nailed it.